Welcome back to Rare Elvis Photos. Hope you enjoyed this look back into history with an article about Elvis Presley, even though it's kind of sad. Uh, let's take a look at it right now. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit all notifications before you leave the channel and check out the other videos. Press. Um, you know, if you're like me, you haven't seen many of these or any of these, and I like to read them and kind of see what was being said, whether it's real or fake or false at the time. It's just in an interesting snapshot in the time of Elvis that doesn't get covered much. All right, let's get started. We're going to start with the strip on the left that says Elvis goes into the hospital for tests. Singer Elvis Presley has been admitted to hospital in Memphis, Tennessee for treatment of a liver problem which has caused a swelling or puffiness to the face. Elvis has a liver problem and it has nothing to do with alcohol, said the friend who did not want to be identified. The friend added, Elvis does not drink. The purpose of the hospital stay is to try to diagnose the nature of the ailment. And he said that Presley's last stay in the hospital in June 1973 was also for the liver problem rather than to treat pleurisy, pleurisy? P-L-E-U-R-I-S-Y, as was, was reported at the Times, and then steroids. The source said doctors were checking for what effect an injection of steroids combined with acupuncture might have had on the entertainer. So this is, that, this is something he had done in California. Um, and that is what caused Elvis Presley's face to go from what we knew it to uh, prior to 1973 to what we knew it after 73 where it was almost always swollen. Okay, so it was reported that Presley had this treatment because of pain in his arms. The hospital would not comment on the report of a liver ailment and said simply that Presley was admitted for a routine checkup. Presley who celebrated his birthday, his 40th birthday on January 8th. Then over here on the top right, you got King Elvis in hospital with liver trouble. You see the date there, the sun, Friday, January 31st, 1973. Elvis Presley, the rock and roll superstar who is now 40 and overweight, boo, was smuggled into the hospital yesterday and a friend said Elvis has a liver problem. But the friend added the problem has nothing to do with alcohol, Elvis does not drink. What type of uh, literary uh, is this? I mean, they basically said that on the other side there. Um, it's believed that the liver problems has made Elvis's face swell and the doctors at the Baptist Memorial, Baptist Hospital in Memphis, are considering injecting injections and acupuncture to combat the disease. Medical experts believe that Elvis may have been receiving treatment for liver problems with a steroid drug, hydrocortisone. Effects. One of the effects of continuous treatment with this drug is that the face of the patient swells up. Presley arrived at the hospital secretly at 4 a.m. and he was taken straight to a suite he has taken on the top floor of the 18-story hospital. Before his arrival, all the windows in the suite were covered with aluminum foil. Uh, the friend said that this was done because Elvis does not like the light when he sleeps. So there you have it. That's a little bit of piece of Elvis history from uh, the 31st of, uh, I believe that was June? No, January. 31st of January, 1973. Um, did you read that article before? Let me know.